satanic or demonic force move by your spirit tonight we pray i humble myself in your presence i decrease that you may increase take take control and charge of this service in the name of jesus let your glory fall like rain you know who we are you know where we are you know where we come from and you know where we're going you know what our needs are tonight meet every need i pray in the name of jesus for you able to do exceeding and abundantly above all that we would ask or think according to the power that worketh in us. Work your power tonight. Yes, Lord. Work your anointing tonight. Yes, Lord. Don't let us leave out of here the way that we came in, but let a transformation Lord. take place tonight. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. In the name of Jesus, give us a noticeable change. Hallelujah. A change whereby even our family will notice yes, it when we get back home. Yes, in the name of Jesus, yes, that they'll know and recognize that we have been yes, in the presence of God. Hallelujah. Show your glory tonight. Yes, Show your glory tonight. Yes, Show your glory tonight. Hallelujah. Back up, devil. The blood of Jesus is against you. Back up, devil. The blood of Jesus is against you. You lose now in the name of Jesus. And God, we give you glory. But thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory in Jesus' name. Amen. Come on and clap your hands and get your seats in the presence of the Lord. I want to preach to you tonight from a subject that simply says, trusting scared. All right. Come on now. Trusting scared. And I know that sounds somewhat like an oxymoron, but if you allow me, I'm going to attempt to express uh, the explicities of this text. Because you're going to see two opposing factors operating at the same time. Mm -hmm. And if you don't watch it, is you'll be easily thrown off uh, by the opposing factors that are functioning in your life at the same time. All right. It is possible to have two totally different things occupying your mind at the same time. Mm -hmm. And so you have to learn how to strategically and effectively deal with the situation without losing sight of your purpose and your destination. Yes, Lord. Because the enemy's objective is to throw you completely off. Mm -hmm. Yes. You do understand that when the enemy attacks your marriage, he really doesn't want your husband. No, no, he can't do nothing with your husband. The enemy wants your purpose. He wants your peace. He wants your joy.